Yeah. My name is David Osborne. Uh, I work for the United Nations Environment Program. I'm based in Nairobi. And uh, this week I'm one of the lead rapporteurs for the theme of managing water across borders. Uh, I think they gave this one to me because uh, my program that I manage is all about uh, managing water from what I call the hilltops to the oceans, H2O, uh, trying to prevent uh, pollutants, the water quality issues, making their way from the water catchment down to the ocean. Sure. So this idea of a rapporteur, yeah. what's that about? Well, I guess we're trying to capture the main messages, the, the new ideas, the innovations that are coming out of the week, uh, and then to help the conference organisers to capture those principles and, or, or ideas yeah. and then to report back to, on them. So at the practical level, how does that process work and how many people are involved? We have a, a wonderful team. Uh, there's a couple of lead rapporteurs and then we have about three or four uh, junior rapporteurs who are running around trying to cover off on various sessions for us, uh, an en- energetic team of, uh, of young rapporteurs. And, and then uh, to, by the end of the week, we'll put our heads together and try to... Uh, again, identify or, the, 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 or capture the main points that have come out of the various sessions across the week. Great. So, and um, we'll be interviewing more of those people this week. Um, I wonder if there's any anything you'd highlight up to now. I mean, we're, we're, this is sort of I sort of call this day day zero. Really. Yeah, it's day zero, kind of the, day yeah. minus one. <laughs> yeah. But is there anything up to now that you'd highlight that you think is relevant, especially uh, on this state? Yeah, zero yeah. I think well, what I think is coming through already is that uh, in terms of water quality, it's absolutely critical that people manage at a ecosystem based level. Yeah. Uh, that, that we really and, and, and ecosystem based management means managing across borders. You cannot uh, do ecosystem based management uh, without managing across borders. Uh, it's critical that governments adopt a hilltops to oceans uh, approach. Uh, obviously, something that's coming out or well, that's lacking at the moment is sometimes the political will to do it, the capacity to do it right, and the finances or resources to do it right now. And that's something that we need to address. But it, it's like the sort of central idea is almost that rivers know, don't know national borders, and actually rivers flow across through many countries and they, they don't they don't regulate themselves based on passing between countries. Absolutely absolutely right. A river makes no distinction between passing from one jurisdiction to the next. Um, and uh, another thing that is really important to emphasise is that water goes downhill. And I think that's often forgotten. And, be, and the, I make that point is to, en- to emphasise that at the end of the day, all these water quality issues that we're dealing with end up in the coastal environment, end up in the, in the marine environment where most of us live, where most of the community or most of the global population are residing. The, the coastal population is burgeoning uh, and we're going to see this continue to grow over the next 20, 30 years and that's in turn pre- receiving pressure from climate change, etc. Uh, we really need to urgently address issues for, cli- for coastal communities by addressing what's going on in the upper catchment in the watershed. Great. Well, thank you very much. You're most welcome.